Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading. Um, for Sagittarius, what are they not telling you? What are they hiding from you? Uh, you can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. This is going to be for August 2022. We are going to take a look at the person that you're currently dealing with or the person that you have on your mind. Uh, we're going to see what this person is not telling you, what they're hiding from you, and then we'll finish off the read to see... Um, if this person will come clean towards you or if you will find out on your own uh, what this person's hiding from you. Apply this to your own unique situation. Switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. Uh, even though this is love focused, this could be with anybody, okay? Um, this could be with a new person, old person. Uh, present person so like i said apply this to your own unique situation okay um if you guys haven't done so yet hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post uh give this video a thumbs up like this video share this video leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective sagittarius people so i'm not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular uh, if you're looking for a reading specific to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Okay, so Sagittarius, let's get started. Tell me about Sagittarius. The person that Sagittarius is dealing with or the person that is on Sagittarius' mind. What is this person hiding from Sagittarius? What is this person hiding from Sagittarius? For August 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Sagittarius. What is this person hiding from Sagittarius? Okay, we have the Eight of Swords and the Sun. Seems like this person's really in their head. I feel like this person's not really happy with the Eight of Wands here and the Queen of Pentacles. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I don't know. I feel like this person's trying to move on from something or that they're trying to run away. Seems like this person's really confused or lost or just paranoid. You got the Nine of Pentacles here in the Devil. I feel like this person fears that you're going to figure out that they are basically not well. This is a very codependent individual. This is a very needed individual. This is an individual that could be very toxic, okay? Um, you know, unwell. Uh, I just feel like maybe this person might have addictions. I, 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 basically, I'm feeling like this person's scared that you're going to see their f mask fall off. Yeah, so I feel like they're definitely hiding their true selves from you which is this devil energy right here. Tell me about this Eight of Swords. Why is this Eight of Swords here? We have the Nine of Wands, the Sun. We have the Chariot, Cancer energy. This is an individual that's very extremely paranoid. Extremely paranoid. Because I feel like this person, mental-wise, I feel like this person's not really doing well. I feel like this person has a lack of self-control too. I, I don't know. I don't want to dog, like dog on someone's mental health, but it just seems like there's something going on here. Something really deep. See, something really serious here. Okay. So uh, the Eight of Wands. Why is the Eight of Wands here? We have the Three of Swords, the uh, Queen of Pentacles, and the Six of Pentacles. Okay. So Three of Swords and the Six of Pentacles here. I don't know. I feel like this person could be breadcrumbing you. You know, I feel like this person definitely is being deceptive, even though the Seven of Swords is not out. I do feel like this person hasn't really been honest with you. I do feel like, I, I feel like you're going to find this out on your own. Yeah. I feel like you're going to find this out on your own because this person is not going to share that with you. The Nine of Pentacles. We have the Five of Pentacles. The Devil in the Strength card. This person has really, 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 really poor self-control. I'm getting a bit of hyperactivity here too and ADHD. This is a very insecure individual. This is a very scared individual because I feel like like if you do find out and when you do find out, this person fears being abandoned. Okay? 
So let's see what else we have here. Will this person come clean towards Sagittarius? Will this person come clean towards Sagittarius for August 2022? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Sagittarius. Will this person come clean towards Sagittarius? Seven of Cups. And with the Seven of Wands, we have the King of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles, the Empress, and the Two of Wands. Okay. The Four of Wands here. Hmm. I don't know. I'm getting an energy with the Seven of Cups and the Seven of Wands here. I feel like this person's going to dance around it. Yeah. So the King of Wands here and the Knight of Pentacles. I mean, I feel like this person comes off as someone here who's very wise, very mature, that very well put together. But it, deep down inside, there's a lot, deep, there's a lot of deep-seated issues here. Okay, with the Empress and the Two of Wands, I don't feel like this person's gonna tell you. The thing is, I feel like you're gonna kind of be patient with this person and let this person reveal themselves to you slowly. But I feel like eventually you're gonna dip out on this person, Sagittarius. Okay. Two of Wands. Yeah, I, I do feel like you're dealing with this feminine energy that's really codependent, very needy, needs a lot of attention, that sort of thing. Uh, you know, this person could text like a million times or call you a million times or something like that out of paranoia because they, they fear losing you. Okay, tell me about the Seven of Cups here. Why is the Seven of Cups here? But I, I feel like you're, you're seeing red flags here. I feel like you're seeing red flags because you're getting confused or that your things are starting to become clear to you. The Ace of Wands. And the Seven of Cups. Tell me about the Seven of Wands here. And the Six of Wands. I feel like you're about to have this aha moment. You know, I feel like you're you're you're, you're going to walk away from this very confidently. Um, you know, I feel like this person is the quite the total total pol quite the total polar opposite of you but i feel like you know when you first met this person this person showed you that they were really confident but in actual in actuality they're really not the king of wands and the emperor here aries energy with the four swords i do feel like you're going to disengage from this person yeah i do feel like you're going to disengage from this person i feel like that empress should be in the reverse uh the empress we have the three of pentacles the two of wands in the tower wow this, their mask is going to fall off. I feel like you're you're going to find out on your own here, Sagittarius. It, it's going to be this person's own doing, you know, you know, because, you know, I mean, this is a cliche, but, you know, things don't stay hidden for a very long time. Eventually, it will come to the surface, and I feel like that's exactly what's going to happen here. And I feel like this person's so paranoid that you're going to see that. And, and then once you figure that out, you're going to run away because, you know, I, I feel like this person has a pattern of doing this or that this person has this uh, behavior, this behavioral pattern. Um, so, uh, you know, this is, this is quite sad because I feel like this person doesn't really have a lot, a lot of people in their life. So I feel like once they meet someone, they really lean on that person immediately, get attached really quickly, okay? So uh, Sagittarius, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks guys, bye.